are here sleepless and we are with J. Cruz. And this is a signal of do not sleep on J. Cruz. J. Cruz, how's it going? My dog, for sure. All right. Hey, we just stopped by to tune in with J. Cruz because you know he's a big um, radio personality out here in Dallas. What made you want to become a radio personality? Was it something planned? Oh, no, it's kind of crazy. Well, me and my brother was rapping. Uh, I'm from originally from New York, but I grew up in Pittsburgh. So me and my brother rapped for like 10 years. So uh, when I, I went to a small school, and it was time to get my internship. I got the internship at a radio station, mainly to try to get my music played. I had a regular job at the radio station. You know, you know, for years I was just trying to get my stuff played and eventually um, I realized that I was good at it and then I was given a shot. So I quit the full-time regular job and started doing the radio. So I kind of fell into it. Yeah. It was just because I was working at the radio station, people helped me realize that I could do the radio jock part of being at the radio station. Yeah, because we all know it might look easy, but... but yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, and there's certain things that you kind of have to have can't be taught how to talk, have a good voice, be personal, you know, all that kind of stuff. So yeah. I kind of had all those traits, so it was, it was a, a blessing people's for me. person. Yeah, a people's person. Yeah. I was already that, so it really worked out. Okay. Well, with this being a segment of sleepless, what is the definition of sleepless to you? Well, I am the definition of sleepless, because I don't get no goddamn <laughs> sleep. So I used to work at nights, right? I used yeah. to work 7 to 12 months at night, 7 to 12 to midnight, Monday to Friday. Okay. So I get off at midnight for clubs during the week. So I get home. You know, my average time falling asleep was three, four o'clock in the morning. So and then I got kids, so I, it's not like I could stay asleep till two. I'd be up by like uh, ten usually. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't yeah. like I was getting like you know getting to sleep in. And now that I'm doing the morning show, it's the complete opposite. I get up at four in the morning yeah. and gotta go to bed like around. Nine, if I want to not be tired the next so day. So usually, like, yeah. usually I don't though. I mean, usually last yeah. night I went to bed at eleven, eleven thirty. Okay. So I, yeah. What? Four hours of sleep. Yeah. I'm going off four hours of sleep right now. So right. sleepless represents me really well, and one of the best decisions I ever made was coming to Dallas. So this T-shirt represents me well. Breaking into the Dallas thing, let me just ask you a question. With everything that's going on with Texas right now, period, with uh, Travis, uh, Scott. With, uh, Travis Scott dropping his album, giving a big dedication to Texas, Houston, all that, what do you think that brings to Texas right now? Oh, I think Texas is booming. People are paying attention. You know what I'm saying? Yellow Beezy's doing his thing, Lil Ronnie's doing his thing, Trapper Freddy's doing his thing. Right. Man, Bobby Five Sessions, sessions. Doing his slow thing. jam. Bobby's uh, doing his thing. What, what's the song he got? Uh, uh, He's just doing his thing, man. He's really got signed to Def Jam. He has very self-conscious music. Mm -hmm. Talks about, you know, tough topics that are going on in our community. Okay. And stuff like that. So, yeah, like I was saying, Texas right now is making noise and people are starting Jay to- Jay Cole it. just tweeted out Oak Cliff. No, he didn't tweet it. He put it in his song. He yeah. says, I'm about to go to Oak Cliff. I'm about to buy the Mavs. Tell Mark Cuban. Like, he literally mentioned Oak Cliff in his freestyle. And that, that goes to show he's paying attention. Yeah, everybody is. I think I, I, people are starting to pay attention. It's a big city. It's a big market. Texas is huge. And there's no reason why we shouldn't be on the radar. 